I think we have a very slippery slope here. New reaction tonight at 10, a local attorney weighing in on a lawsuit filed against the state, accusing Attorney General Steve Marshall of violating the civil rights of people who get abortions where the procedure is still legal. The lawsuits claim that the state is wrongfully enforcing the conspiracy statute to punish women's rights groups for helping others obtain out-of-state abortions. In a filing Wednesday, Marshall asked for this case to be thrown out, citing that conspiring to have an abortion elsewhere while in the state of Alabama is a crime, and he's committed to prosecuting it. Well, tonight we're speaking with the co-chair of the Alabama chapter of the National Lawyers Guild, who says that how this case plays out in court could have far-reaching impacts. The question is, in this case, is it absurd and is it illogical to think that some future governor or even the present governor uh, would want to have a law that says people can't do X, Y, or Z, and if they go somewhere else where they can do it, they can be prosecuted here when they come back. And I think that's something we should all, you know, at least reflect on and worry about. Now, Attorney David Gespaz is not associated with this lawsuit. We did reach out to AG General's office, or AG Marshall, rather, office for comment. We have not heard back.